All right, this is just a quick PSA, if you will. Um, so first of all, hi, sorry, I haven't made a video in a while. I got, I got a video that I still need to kind of finish up, so I'm painting my dad's truck, but just here's a heads up. If you own a Yamaha, especially a Yamaha Apex or Attack or RX-1 or RX-1 Warrior, basically any Yamaha. So my advice to you is like this bearing right here, make sure it's, it's like an OEM Yamaha. Or, I mean, this one's okay, but any bearing that has, like, a taper on it, make sure that you get the OEM one. Because, like, oh, gosh. I mean, all these chain case bearings are right. I mean, as you can see, the chain case is basically together. But, so, the problem with this one is it's supposed to have a taper on the inside, right? Like, a good taper to fit this. Because, I mean, we had, where is it? This right here. We had this on there. And then we had this hammer put flat on there and then this hammer banging on it and just absolutely wailing on it and it was not going in and then uh, I'm on the Yamaha Ibex Owners Club on Facebook and they go yep you need the correct bearing for that you have to have a OEM Yamaha one because they don't have the enough of a tear, uh, taper so these are Koyo so they're good bearings they're not horrible but um, yeah no like this one here has an oblong taper to it, kind of, sort of. But that one's okay. That, that one's good. This one's not. So shit, we gotta order any one of those now. Now we gotta order an OEM one, heat this up, pop that back out, and take the drive shaft out, and probably, unfortunately, <laughs> take the chain back off, <laughs> loosen the chain, untorque this, take that off, take all that back out, at least get this top shaft out. Oh yeah, and untorque that. <sighs> so shit. Oh yeah, what do you guys think of the beard? Do a no shave November. Um, some people say no shave September, but whatever, I do no shave November. Anyways, doesn't matter. So yeah, just a PSA. Uh, haven't really made an update on this at all. Got my brother's sled torn apart. I don't know. If you see this and anyone, just if you get this far in the video, it's a short video. So I mean, hey, if you wanna see Sled stuff, uh, I gotta work on my Warrior this year because I'm not gonna be riding the, my ND5. I'm riding the Yamaha Warrior this year, so I don't know if you guys wanna see videos on that, but um, as far as this goes, this is done for a while. We gotta order that. I mean, we can at least put the skid back in and the skis, but we can't put the tank and seat back on and stuff. It can't start looking like a sled. <sighs> Shit. So. But that's, that's all I got for you guys today. Kind of a disappointment. But just please order OEM bearings. Like, especially if it's for your jack shaft or your drive shaft. So many people on there said there's no replacement for, or no aftermarket for that is as good as original. But uh, yeah, so that's all I got for you guys. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Don't be disappointed. And uh, just, just get out, yeah. So, anyways, thanks for watching.